my butt look good in this? No. <laughs> Poppy on, it's your boy J. Michael. Welcome, welcome back to another weekly vlog. I'm starting this vlog off kind of sort of late. It's like 4 15. Usually, I started more so closer to the morning. I just didn't feel like it. I honestly wasn't gonna vlog today, but yeah, change my mind. I went to the gym. I just went over some stuff for my pride show, so super excited for that. Can't wait till you know that whole thing come together. I really turned on the um, camera because I got me a little package. My mother is being honored at the Black Honors Music Awards, the Black Music Honor Awards, whatever. I have to order some stuff, cause baby, I need to look good. These are the shoes. My suit comes, I don't even know what my suit comes, but these are my shoes actually. I was thought my suit was supposed to come before my shoes, but yeah, that's a, that's whatever. Let's go ahead and open these bad boys up. Y'all know I love me a good boot. That's exactly what we got, a good boot. I'm excited. Uh-oh. Like, come on now. Come on now, y'all know I had to come through with the boot. This is a little inspiration. I'm kind of biting the model style just a little bit because I got my suit from Boohoo. That's where I get all my suits from for the most part. They have like, uh, if you shop on Boohoo, you know sometimes when you swipe, they'll have like models have like different shoes or something like that. This one picture, the model had on an outfit, black shirt, black bow tie, literally doing the same exact thing. But he had like these patent leather dress shoes. They weren't heeled or anything like that, but they were still patent leather dress shoes. I was like, gave me the idea so i'm in the asos and i was like let me see if they got some black patent leather you know dress shoes because i have the red version of this but they have two zippers one on each side but yeah i was like oh let me see if asos got them and best believe <laughs> i stumbled across them so yeah baby let me try this other one on these aren't as high as the last pair i bought thank the lord because my feet was hurting let me put y'all on the floor so y'all can see what So today, I really don't have anything planned, honestly. I pretty much did everything I was supposed to do. I have a workout class actually at six. It's a core class, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna go, honestly, because I really don't feel like it. Today just wasn't a day where I just worked out really, really hard. I don't know, I just, I started feeling a little queasy. I'm starting to think that it might be the creatine. That's what I'm starting to think it is because before I was going to the gym, working out, doing my big one, but now, I don't know, I think it's the creatine. That might be the food. Yeah, we just ordered Applebee's. Yeah, child. I just wanted to kind of start the vlog off because I want to show my shoes or whatever. If I don't talk to y'all today, I'll probably talk to y'all tomorrow.
Your boy is leaving the gym. Started working out around 10.30, did some cardio, chest, biceps, abs, and then I kind of just was talking or whatever. Now I'm on my way back home because I actually have some business that I need to take care of. I have two business calls I have to get on. One is at two o'clock. I actually have to shoot a text over to the CEO so I can kind of confirm this phone call. And then I have to talk to a business partner. Uh, I'm not even sure what he wants to talk about, but yeah, I'm a okay you going entirely too slow <laughs> let's pick up the place yeah i'm not entirely too sure what exactly he wants to talk about but i do know that he actually wanted me to call him this morning but um i told him i was on the way to the gym so he said that would be better for me to just call him afterwards this invoice needs to be paid for the rehearsal space i checked for availability this morning actually if y'all know this but you can schedule when you send off an email so majority of the time since i do a lot of work at night which I, I really need to stop doing it. i'm trying to get a better schedule but since i do a lot of my work at night and i think it's like foolish for to send a good morning email when it's like 12 o'clock at night i will schedule my emails i typed up an email last night around what 12 15 12 30 and i had scheduled it to be sent off first thing this morning around eight o'clock availability is a okay so I'ma get that paid and have that locked in. I need to let my dancers know the exact dates. Hours, I believe for my dancers, it's four hours that I'll be rehearsing with them. And for me, it's a good five hours. All together, I'll be rehearsing for like 55 hours, I wanna say. Yeah, I'm ready, y'all. Like, I'm about to be putting in some work over these next two months. So I would love to just do something that kind of just really represents me. Ooh, okay, let me find out! Let me find out! Oh, all right, so first business call is now taken care of. Let me go ahead and call my business partners, see what, what the deal is, baby. I'm very, very excited. I don't know how you looked over everything. We just got to see how you want to do it and then go from there. As far as the video? Uh, yeah. Okay. All right, 10 four. All right. All right, well, that was quick. <laughs> I am, shoot, I signed up for a core class. I know I'm not going to be able to go to that. So let me just go ahead and unregister. Unregister. Yes, I'm registered now. That way, or it wasn't actually a core class. It was a um, body pump class. I'll do that tomorrow. I did enough working out today. I was going to do a get ready with me, but I think I'm just going to end up doing a what's in my bag summer edition. Y'all loved my last what's in my bag. And that was around like the winter time because I had did it with the Balenci bag that I had just got for Christmas. It's time for me to stop slacking so much. I'm always laying down, always edit at the last minute, finally taking accountability for that stuff. <laughs> so now it's getting back on my sugar honey iced tea and letting the people know that I'm not the one to play with. All right, y'all. So if the audio sounds a little different, that's because I'm actually about to film. I took the mic off of this camera to put on this camera. I'm pretty sure, yeah, I've shown you guys my lighting setup or whatever, which is going to change pretty soon because I'm going to upgrade my lights, but let's see the hair there right now. I'm about to go ahead and film this video. I was going to take pictures afterwards, but when I was going to take pictures in, I'd rather save that for something else. Yeah, I'd rather just save that outfit for something else because I feel like I could definitely get some like wear out of it and get some really, really good pictures in it. So yeah, I'm not even going to bother. I am going to do a what's in my bag summer edition. Y'all loved. When I tell y'all, y'all ate the last one up baby okay so i'm gonna come back with another one for y'all talk about what's in one of my favorite bags ever if you want to know what bag i'm talking about y'all go ahead and watch the video by the time this vlog is out this video that i'm about to film should already be out let me go ahead and film this video because i also want to go to the store too and i gotta go to mcdonald's pick the kids food up so let me go ahead and do what i got to do i will speak to you guys when i'm all done Whew. All right, y'all. Your boy has finally finished. This video's gonna come out really, really good. I'm excited. Granted, some of the stuff in here is like kind of like a repetition thing, but because I've got some new subscribers and of course I'm carrying a few new products in my bag, I thought that it would be nice to, you know, come back with another one for you guys. A lot of y'all were requesting this when I dropped the last one, so. I'm about to change my clothes. I'm gonna put on a sweatsuit because I'm pretty sure it's cooling down now. What time is it? 553. Alexa, what, what's the temperature? Right now, it's 68 degrees Fahrenheit. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and put on sweats. What's good, y'all? So, it's the next day, and if I were to be honest, I really didn't have no intentions on vlogging today, simply because I really didn't have anything to do. Let me rephrase that. I really didn't intend on talking to y'all today, because I didn't really have anything to do. But, we got a little P.O. box opening. Somebody reached out to me maybe about a week ago, and asked me if they can send one of their bags, which one, I don't even know how they got my, that doesn't even matter. But, um, they sent this to my P.O. box. I always make it known that you guys can always send me stuff to my P.O. box, but just ask for it. I don't make my P.O. box public anymore because somebody's being a weirdo and sending me all types of notes and stuff like that. So I don't make it public anymore. But if you want to send me something, reach out to me on DM or email me or something of that nature and I will gladly give you the P.O. box after you tell me what exactly you're sending because yeah, we don't play those games over here. But let's go ahead and open this up. This is from Glam Boss. I will make sure to put her, you know, info on the screen for y'all. She got professional and stuff. Look, she got her own tape. She got her own tape and everything. I know that's right, girl. You gotta let me know where you got that tape from because I'm gonna get some for my grandma. Hold up. Mmm. Okay, it smells good. This is the info. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Thank you for your order. Y'all can have a 10% off coupon using Glam Boss. I'll put it up on the screen. Are these real flower petals? No. Okay, dust bag. She is legit official. Okay, dust bag. Let's see what this is given. Oh, this is cute. Look, it's like a little quilted, little glam boss or whatever. It gives me like tail far dupe, luxury tail far dupe, but with the quilted design. It has like a cute zipper at the top. Oh, this is cute. Oh yeah, red interior, baby, this is cute. Well, thank you so much, girl, for sending me this bag. Yeah, this is cute. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Oh, that's nuts, baby. Let go. No time for life and any. More life than this, more money. In my life today, God on my side today. Can't decide, oh. But that's the honey and nice, can't decide, oh What are the we gon' cool my mind? No stress, no enemy That boy used to be a friend of me XO, what she sent to me Say me can't let them boy get to me I'm in the mood I'm in the mega mood High life, get away Tough life, far away from you I wanna see the view the world, I wanna be on beach side in Cancun. Tell me what you wanna do. And you let the world know the guy knew. Been long since I was back home. Remember days you was on the back bro. Till the love is out. What's poppin' y'all? So it's the next day, and I'm actually about to eat some lunch. Usually I'd be out probably on my way home from the gym by this time, or like just now finishing up, but I didn't go today, and I'm probably not gonna go today. Only because I was supposed to go this morning, didn't go this morning. I was supposed to go really, really early because I thought I had to get on a Google Meet today at 11. Y'all know I used to go to the gym around like 10, so that wouldn't have worked out. Turns out the Google Meet is on the 17th. Today is, I don't know what today's date is, maybe like the third? Nonetheless, I had the wrong day. Could've went to the gym, but it doesn't matter at this point because I'm not going so I'm gonna eat me some lunch I'm gonna eat my leftovers from yesterday I had a lot of food left over so this is what I have I feel like Ariana Grande with this big old hoodie covering my hands one of my favorite hoodies because it's so oversized later on today we are well, not really later on today but me and my grandma are going bowling today I'm just really I'm kind of upset that I didn't get to go to the gym today all because my schedule was conflicted which is again why I need to write stuff down on my calendar I actually need to go and fill in a few dates yeah, right into that. But I'm finished to eat. Food all warmed up. So good. So freaking good. I have to get some new batteries for my tripod because it's not working. You already know the scent for today is Citizen Jack, which still I have to re-up because baby, I'm running out. I just had a business call and I'm super excited excited of what is to come. This is going to be a good summer. I can already tell it's gonna be a good summer. I got some stuff for y'all. Y'all aren't ready, honey. Can't wait. White hoodie, uh, these gray sweatpants with like the denim detail products on my feet. And I'm gonna carry this right here. Put this around my waist. <laughs> what waist? Oh, no, I'm just playing. I look fat. I'm not about to do that. 
<laughs> I'm not about to do that. We're just gonna carry it like how we usually carry it. Like this. Yeah, I know me. Alright, this is the fit. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Nothing spectacular. I'm about to head out, take some shades, and we are ready. Let's go ahead and head to the bottom alley. So we done bowling. We done bowling. She won both games. She won both games, baby. She got like, I think, 140 something this last one. Yeah. I don't remember what she got the first time around. I'll take a picture of it though. <laughs> mm hmm. But now, home we go. Kids is home. Go entertain them. Make sure that girl room's clean. I don't know what I'm gonna cook today though. Not yet. I already ate my leftovers earlier. What you gonna eat? I'm thinking of beef stew. What mm. is that they like? Ravioli? No, for Tuesday. Tacos? Yeah. They haven't had that in a while. Yeah, they haven't. But tonight, I got a feeling tonight won't be it. It won't. <laughs> <laughs> What's poppin' y'all? So, I'm gonna make the kids some some chicken nuggets. I'm going to put them in the Ninja. I'm gonna air crisp them or air fry them. I'm gonna do that with some fries. Me, on the other hand, what I'm going to have, actually, I need to. I need to tornado in Los Angeles. What? Since when? Does LA get tornadoes? I mean, at this point, anything is possible in this world. I have the Weather Channel app. I pay for like premium every month. It's like, not every month, every year. It's like $10 a year. Yeah, it's way better than the generic weather app that comes with the iPhone. Love me some Instacart. But yeah, I'm finna make them food with some fries. I'm gonna have some beef stew with some rice. It's actually cooking right now to be done in like eight minutes. So no replacement refund instead. No. Okay. So yeah, uh, my food's almost done. I'm about to start my food. My mom ordered something else that I gotta put together. So I'm gonna do that also after I eat. It's a little box, so I don't think it will take much effort. But then again, that laundry basket, that put me through hell a little bit. It took me a little minute for me to, you know, get it together. I, know I don't really like reading directions, so that was probably the case, but mm -mm. So we're gonna hope and pray that it's not super duper extra. Food good? Yeah. How's your food? Good. It's good. You sure it's good? Yes. You sure? Mm -hmm. I just finished heating up my food for the longest. Now I'm gonna eat and then put together the shelf for two mom today. Food was A1. Like, hello. I didn't expect any different because my grandmother's cooking as always. Top tier. I'm about to put together this shelf is what I now know what it is. It's like an acrylic shelf, so I'm gonna put this together, but I wanted to show y'all something, okay? And I think it's so crazy because I literally just saw an advertisement for this and I came home and it was downstairs and I was like, what in the world? So, as y'all know, summer is approaching, right? Y'all need to get this right here. I literally just saw an ad for this. I'm telling y'all, I think it's gonna be the bomb.com for the summer. You know, with the mosquitoes and the flies and all that good stuff, it's going to be a lifesaver. This is a light by Zevo, and not really Light. It's like a little plug-in light or whatever by Zevo. And I believe we have other products by them too, like their spray and other stuff. What this does is the blue light attracts all the bugs, the flies, the mosquitoes and whatnot into the light and literally kills them. This is a whole killer for bugs. I just thought it was so cool because like, I come home from the bowling alley to like a product I literally just saw last night. I don't remember what I was watching. It had to have been Hulu or something because that's the only way that I would probably see any commercials from Hulu because I watch Hulu Live. We have Hulu Live. Y'all know I don't have cable upstairs in my room. I took it out. Well, I have cable, but I don't have a cable box in there. If that makes sense. I just thought it was so funny. Like, oh my God, what a coincidence. I literally saw this last night. And here it is. That's so crazy. Let's go ahead and put this little thing together. Nobody will love. I'm right with my nigga. I'm sliding in the world. It's a dream so It's just good to good. Y'all want to be right. Y'all want to be right. My tears can't hide. I want you to do it.
my job To make you feel What you trying to meet your maker, darling? Oh, you running out of time, huh? But I can tell you, surely I ain't no game, baby God bless me God help me Oh, I think I'm insane What to do, y'all? So, it's the next day, and I just had the best workout. I say that, like, literally all the time, but this time it's true. I really did have a really good workout. Less than three weeks until rehearsals, so I am going hard in the gym, running on a treadmill, like, I'm about to run a marathon, baby. This year, I'm finna show the folks what I'm made of. I am going to the car wash right now, because my car is filthy, both inside and out. Dang, okay, everybody's here getting a car wash. The line is hella long. Wow. Wow. Okay, everybody had the same idea as me. Some bird decided that they want to just use the bathroom on my window, so it's literally bird poop all over my window, up here, pollen. It just, I really need to clean the mess out of my car and I need to pass by some time. I'm about to meet my business partner at one because we are going to look at a venue to shoot Never Be At. One of the venues to shoot Never Be At. I'm super excited about everything that is about to come to fruition. After that, I have a Google Meet tonight with a pretty big app, actually. I have to reread a contract that I I got yesterday this is just to anybody who is you know a content creator trying to get in the industry or anything of that nature you deal with contracts please please it's one thing if you let other people read your contracts okay that's cool that's fine that's dandy you should always have a second opinion but you yourself should be reading your contract over from front to back back to front regardless if you understand it or not but you should always read your stuff you should always read it it doesn't matter if you understand it or not you should always read your stuff just so you know what is in that contract point blank period you should always read your stuff you hear a lot about the people who are getting cheated out their money or there's a lot of underhanded stuff that happens under the table why because people are not reading their contracts for themselves as for anybody out there who you know is about to get in into the business you got contract please read over it I have to read over that contract and then i'll probably have to read over the contract with the people i'm meeting with today because i'm pretty sure that i'm gonna end up going through with them especially if the money is what i believe it's gonna be because y'all know i'm all about my coin i'm so tired i went to sleep at like four o'clock last night staying up editing a video and it's so crazy i was editing for like three four hours and i only edited it about 20 minutes I had 20 minutes already edited I edited another 20 minutes so it was like up to 44 minutes and I still had an hour of footage left hour of footage left like oof child but I'm definitely gonna finish that vlog today and if I finish in a decent amount of time I'm uploading it today okay I am so behind on my vlogs and I need to just push them out so I can be back on track I'm gonna get my vlogs together and then I'm gonna go ahead and start editing my sit-down videos this weekend when I cut my hair I well actually tomorrow because I am supposed to be going somewhere tomorrow y'all remember that weekend where we were supposed to be going to like the adventure thing and it got rescheduled because of the rain well it's rescheduled till tomorrow so tomorrow Tomorrow I'll be vlogging and whatnot. I'll probably do a get ready with me for that. So I either cut my hair tomorrow or tonight. I haven't decided yet. I hit my MD up to see if I like I should have a list of all this stuff written out. I just don't. <laughs> That's probably why I'm so frantic and all over the place. Uh, oh my god. Like I'm literally all over the place. This is probably the most busiest week I've had in a minute. And when it comes to business, between the phone calls and the editing and the back and forth emails and the contracts, this is a lot. I'm about to bring on somebody else on my team. Yeah. I just, y'all... Uh this is what I wanted. <laughs> While I'm over here at the store, I'm gonna go ahead and get another battery for my tripod because this is not working. The battery has died, so I'm gonna look at what batteries this requires. And I'm right here at Walmart. I gotta get gas, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get some batteries as well because I need some. Let's turn these windshield wipers off, so I don't worry about them. But yeah, I'm tired, y'all. But you know the grind don't stop. We gotta get this coin. But I'm about to go into this car wash. Y'all probably not gonna be able to hear me, so yeah. I haven't been like this tired in so long, like to the point where I'm low-key exhausted.
Alright y'all, so I am at the gas station and I actually want to try something that I saw on Twitter. So it's like this thing that they said like if you press enter, you can put in like the amount of like money you want to pump into the gas. So it's almost like if you went inside and said I want like $30 or $40 on pump whatever. So I'm going to try that today and see if that's actually the case because the person even worked at a gas station and said he didn't know that you can do that. We're going to try it out today or we're going to see. So let's go Joe. So that hack indeed does not work. I'm not quite sure what I'm doing wrong, or maybe I'm just doing it wrong, maybe I didn't do it right, or maybe I'm not at the right gas station, but I did what the guy did in the video, and it didn't work. So it's given hoax, and I don't like that. So I am now back in the car. Last time I talked to y'all, what was I doing? I was at the gas station. That hack that they talking about was working, yeah, it didn't work. Maybe I did it wrong, I'm not sure, but whatever. I'm on my way to the store, then I'm going go home. I checked out two locations, actually, for Never Be. I found the place that I am going to be filming it at. So now it's just getting a whole bunch of other stuff together. Yeah, I am super excited. I can't wait for all of this to come together. Yeah, I am ready for everything. Yeah, I still got a mile today. I totally forgot. Actually, no, not I didn't forget. I didn't know it was Cinco de Mayo. I don't be keeping up with that stuff. I was never somebody who celebrated Cinco de Mayo. I didn't even celebrate it when I was in Vegas. So yeah, I was like, okay, Cinco de Mayo, period. I still have stuff that I got to do. I'm gonna go stop by the store real quick. I got to rush over there. It's gonna take like 30 minutes to get there because it's pretty much traffic time. So I'm gonna hop right on the highway so I can be a speedy Gonzalez and get home before I get on this Zoom call. Not or Google Meets call. All right. Well, I have a good feeling about this. Yes, Jay. I do too. After you sign a contract, I do want to invite you for another call and we can jam up all the campaign and tell me about your ideas. Okay. All the ingredients is here. I want you to be the cook, but you know, I'm a little chef here. If there's <laughs> anything you need, um, I can definitely help and give you some ideas. Okay. Thank you. I'm excited. Of course. Thank you so much, Jay. Again, my name is Hope you have a good day. Yes, you too. Awesome. Take care. Bye-bye. It's giving money. Yes. <laughs> it's giving money. <laughs> What's good, y'all? So it's the next day. Honestly, I was not gonna vlog today, but here I am. I'm all dressed. Just finished filming at Get Ready With Me, actually. I wore this already before, but I didn't really go nowhere, so I'm wearing it again. But we're going to the adventure place thing that we tried to go to the other week, but it was raining, so we couldn't go. So we're about to head there. We're going to Chili's first, get something to eat. Yeah, I'm excited. It's gonna be fun. I love the zip line, and that's what we're gonna do, so. Chop and screw the head, down to the deal. Like, at this point, I need a, my own barbershop, like, I do have to cut my hair down though because it's getting too tall. Let's go ahead and have some fun, y'all. Because I'm ready. I'm excited. I have been meaning to go here. Well, I was supposed to go here like a few years ago, but something happened. Some drama happened, so I didn't go. But yeah. Let's go. Alrighty, I got you, sir. And I'm going to have the triple dipper. Okay. Uh, I'll have the, the double burger bites. I'll have the triple dipper as well. Alrighty. With uh, the sliders with just cheese and bacon on it, no onions. Just cheese and bacon? No yep. Onions. And then the side of fries. Stop, stop, stop it. Thank you. And if y'all need anything else, just let me know. Thank you. On your paper. How? Say hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hi. hi. How are you guys today? Good. Do you hear Alright y'all, so we just finished okay. eating! Okay. Leaving Chili's now. Now we're gonna go to the place to go. Zip line, look at the doggy! We're gonna go to the place now to go. Zip lining. So it's like a zip lining and that's it, right? Yeah. Yeah, but well, we're gonna have us a nice little hoop, a nice little tan. Okay guys, so I'm vlogging off my phone now because I wasn't sure if I could bring my phone out, but uh, my camera out rather, but we're walking to the place. It has like animals here and everything. Okay, guys, so we're done. I done got cut up. I don't know if y'all can see. 
I'm gonna show you when I get home. I got stuck, or not I got stuck. I got cut up, some kid got stuck, DJ got stuck, started crying. She was crying. I wasn't crying. Hey. I was. Child, I'm ready to go home. Food is so big, work, Lord. All right, y'all. So I'm back home. Let me tell y'all something, okay? This is nothing that I expected it to be. A little obstacle thing. The the I thought we were going zip lining. That is not what it was. It was literally a obstacle course and zip lining combined together. So think of like wipeout or like ninja warrior but like watered down a little bit yeah that's what it was giving i cut my hand i don't know if y'all can see but i cut my hand i cut my knee under here it's like it's not like burn but like i don't <sighs> long story short your boy is beat up <laughs> i am beat up i wanted to finish the obstacle course that i was doing it was called the black hawk first of all if you're in the 757 area go to adventure park that's where we were i did something called the black hawk right and i did it because it was five zip lining things and two of them were over the water so i was like you know that was my motivation i was like i really want to go over the water like that's my motivation that's what i'm gonna do so First strike, my jewelry started coming undone, right? I had a, a gold watch and my bracelet, like my typical gold jewelry. Strike number two, when I looked down and saw that my freaking hand or my finger was bleeding. Strike three was the kid in front of me got stuck. I was like, you know what? <laughs> Let me get off of this. I feel like I will be the one to get stuck at a place where it's just so unconventional. And it was getting dark. I was like, yeah, let me just go ahead and call it a day. I'm pissed to go. So I took the little emergency route and I got off, but I was not dressed right. I'm definitely, I don't know. I didn't get this dirty. Thank the Lord I didn't get this dirty because this is actually a really, really nice set. And my butt look good in this. Nothing. <laughs> yeah, I didn't really dress the part. Um, I probably am gonna have to get, yeah, I'm probably put this in the dirty clothes, the top at least. And the bottom, what in the world? Yeah, I got, yeah, I'm gonna have to put this in the dirty clothes. I wanted to go back maybe with Nick and Alden cause Nick is coming home. He'll be home for like a week. So he gets home this upcoming Monday. I'm so excited, like I'm finna tee up for real. The boys should be reunited again. If you are an OG, especially if you're here during the quarantine days, y'all know Nick and Alden, my best friends, my brothers at this point, like we about to be reunited and it is, I'm so excited, but that's neither here or there. Wait a minute, did I cut my face too? This is blood! Oh my god, I hope I didn't cut my face. And I really hope it's just from my hand. Oh god. Yeah, oh, whatever. Okay. I'm home, so it really don't matter. I needed that. But, on another note, y'all, I want to show you guys the mess that I... Well, not really a mess, but I want to show you guys the behind the scenes of my Get Ready With Me's. Because I don't know if you guys ever have seen, like, what it looks like when I'm filming my Get Ready With Me's. So, this is the behind the scenes of my Get Ready With Me's. I move my little thing, put it right here, set up my makeup and stuff of that nature. My camera usually goes where the mirror is and all that good stuff. This is what it gives. And on camera, it does not look like you know any of that stuff is there but this is the behind the scenes of everything yeah i just wanted to show y'all that because i feel like y'all would appreciate seeing that i don't know but i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog off now because i just i want to wipe all the stuff off my face take a good shower clean up just relax i hope you guys all enjoyed this video make sure you guys like this video and subscribe to my channel follow me on my socials my instagram my twitter my tiktok all that guys at j michael you already know the deal if you see me anywhere else nine times out of ten it is not your boy okay so don't be falling for nobody's trick <laughs> i love y'all and i will see y'all in the next video. Peace.